Hi, this video is designed for you to do some easy standing exercises at home. The only equipment you'll need is what you can find in your own house. Try and do all of these exercises 10 times on each arm and leg. You can combine these exercises with the seated exercises found in one of the other videos on this channel. Standing up from a chair. Use your hands to push up if you need to, but if you can do it with your arms crossed, do that as well. Control your descent when you sit down. This is a great exercise for strengthening all of your leg muscles. Stand with your feet slightly wider than shoulder width. Bend down and keep your knees over your toes. Keep your chest up like you're sitting on a chair. Only go as far as is comfortable. March on the spot. Hold on to something sturdy for balance. Try to lift your knees up nice and high. Stand up straight, have your feet together. Hold onto something sturdy for balance. Lift up onto your toes and come back down. To make this harder, if your balance is okay, do this on one foot or with your heels off a step. Stand up straight with your feet together. Lift your foot backwards and bend your knee towards your bottom like you're going to kick your bottom. Don't worry if you can't get up very high. If you feel like you're going to cramp, stretch out your hamstrings. Standing tall, holding on to something sturdy. Keep your knees straight and push your legs straight back. Try and keep your trunk straight up. Lift one leg out to the side. You don't need to get very high up, but it is important not to lean over. You should feel a burning in your bottom muscles. This is the hardest exercise of the video. Take a big step forwards, lift your back heel off the floor and bend straight down. Don't let your front knee go over your toes. You will mostly feel it in your back leg. Don't go so far down if you can't get back up. Take a step forwards and out to the side with both feet. Then come back in with your feet together. Out, out, in, in. To make it more challenging, take your arms out in time with your feet. You can do this on and off a step. For this exercise, you will need a step. You can use a step into your house or an exercise step. If you need to hold onto a rail, please do so to keep safe. Step onto the step and back down. Up, up, down, down. Repeat on both legs. If you're feeling like you want to be challenged, do this faster, but please be safe and watch where you put your feet. The next exercise we are going to do is a wall push up. You can use a sturdy chair or a wall. As you go down, keep a straight line from your head to your ankles. You can make it easier or harder by standing up more or by being closer to the floor. Grab some weights. They could even be a tin of beans. Lift your arms out to the side and then straight in front of you. You can change it up by lifting one out to the front and one out to the side and then swapping. Here we have some clock taps. Balancing on one leg, touch the ground out in the front, to the side, behind, and then across the back like a curtsy. Do it on both legs. Hold a sturdy chair or bench for balance. Tandem walking. Do this by your bench or a sturdy long table. Pretend you're walking along a tightrope. If you're a bit too wobbly, just bring your feet out for a bit more balance. When you are walking backwards, please make sure you are holding onto your bench or table and that there are no hazards in your way because you won't be able to see where you're going. Lift your feet up enough to be safe and clear the floor.